The lymphatic system is an essential component of the human body's immune system. It plays a crucial role in maintaining tissue homeostasis, defending against pathogens, and facilitating the transport of nutrients and waste products. In this comprehensive script, we will explore the intricate structure and functions of the lymphatic system, including the lymphatic capillaries, vessels, nodes, organs, and their relevance in various physiological and pathological conditions. The lymphatic system is a network of organs, vessels, and nodes that work alongside the cardiovascular system. It transports excess fluid, solutes, and immune cells from tissues to the bloodstream, playing a crucial role in immune responses, such as eliminating pathogens and foreign antigens. Lymphatic capillaries are tiny, blind-ended vessels that originate in the interstitial spaces of most tissues. These specialized capillaries are composed of a single layer of endothelial cells, loosely arranged and overlapping, creating flap-like endothelial mini-valves. These valves allow for the entry of lymphatic fluid, proteins, and cellular debris into the lymphatic capillary but prevent its backflow. The lymphatic capillaries are highly permeable, making them efficient in draining excess interstitial fluid and macromolecules. Beyond the lymphatic capillaries, lymphatic vessels form an extensive network that gradually increases in size and complexity. The lymphatic vessels have three distinct layers, an inner endothelial lining, a medial layer composed of smooth muscle, and an outer layer of connective tissue. This layered structure helps propel the lymphatic fluid forward through rhythmic contractions of the smooth muscle, supporting the unidirectional flow of lymph. Additionally, lymph vessels contain regular lymphangians, small compartments with valves that further aid in maintaining the forward flow of lymph. Lymph nodes are small, bean-shaped organs strategically positioned along the lymphatic pathways. They act as important filtering stations and play a crucial role in the immune response. Lymph nodes are composed of a fibrous capsule that encloses lymphatic tissue divided into distinct regions called the cortex and medulla. The cortex contains densely packed lymphocytes, mainly B cells, while the medulla houses antibody-producing plasma cells, macrophages, and other immune cells. Lymph nodes filter the lymph, removing foreign antigens, pathogens, and cellular debris, thereby initiating an immune response when necessary. Apart from lymph nodes, the lymphatic system consists of various other organs that contribute to immune function. These organs include the spleen, thymus, and tonsils. The spleen acts as a blood filter and reservoir, removing old and damaged red blood cells, as well as initiating immune responses against bloodborne pathogens. The thymus is primarily involved in the maturation of T lymphocytes, crucial for cell-mediated immunity. Tonsils, along with the mucosa-associated lymphoid tissue, MALT, are responsible for trapping and eliminating pathogens entering through the respiratory and gastrointestinal tracts. Tonsils are collections of lymphoid tissue located at the back of the throat. These structures include the pharyngeal tonsil, adenoids, palatine tonsils, and lingual tonsils. They act as a first line of defense against inhaled or ingested pathogens by trapping and initiating an immune response against them. Mucosa-associated lymphoid tissue, MALT, refers to a diffuse network of lymphoid tissue present throughout the mucosa of various organs, such as the respiratory, digestive, and genitourinary tracts. Malt provides localized protection and immune surveillance against pathogens invading these mucosal surfaces. The lymphatic system's filtering function is crucial in removing and neutralizing harmful substances, microorganisms, and abnormal cells. As lymph fluid passes through lymph nodes, resident immune cells, including lymphocytes, macrophages, and dendritic cells, scan the lymph for foreign antigens. They recognize, bind, and initiate an immune response against these antigens, facilitating their destruction and preventing the spread of infection. This immune surveillance mechanism helps protect the body from a wide range of pathogens. The lymphatic system can be a conduit for the spread of cancer cells. Cancer cells can invade lymphatic vessels and travel to regional lymph nodes, leading to tumor metastasis. The presence of cancer cells within lymph nodes is an important staging factor in cancer diagnosis and prognosis. Understanding the role of the lymphatic system in cancer dissemination is critical in developing targeted therapies and improving patient outcomes. Edema refers to the accumulation of excess fluid in the interstitial spaces, leading to tissue swelling. The lymphatic system plays a vital role in maintaining fluid balance by draining excess interstitial fluid. When the lymphatic system becomes impaired or overloaded, such as in lymphedema or infection, its ability to remove fluid is compromised, resulting in edema. Understanding the intricate relationship between the lymphatic system and edema is crucial for effective management and treatment of these conditions. Lymphogenesis refers to the formation and development of lymphatic vessels during embryonic development. 
Initial lymphatic vessels form through a process called lymphangiogenesis, which involves sprouting of lymphatic endothelial cells from pre-existing venous capillaries. Lymphangiogenesis also plays a significant role in tissue repair, inflammation, and tumor progression. Understanding these processes provides insights into potential therapeutic targets for conditions related to abnormal lymphatic vessel growth. In addition to adaptive immunity, the lymphatic system also contributes to innate immunity, the body's immediate defense mechanisms against pathogens. Innate immune cells, such as macrophages and natural killer NK, cells, are present within lymphatic organs and contribute to the recognition and elimination of pathogens. Lymphatic vessels also facilitate the transport of innate immune cells to sites of infection or inflammation, enhancing their ability to combat pathogens effectively. Various immune disorders can impact the proper functioning of the lymphatic system. Conditions such as lymphadenopathy, lymphangitis, lymphoma, and autoimmune diseases can cause structural abnormalities, impair lymph flow, or affect immune cell populations within lymphatic organs. Understanding the underlying mechanisms of these disorders is crucial for accurate diagnosis, effective management, and developing targeted therapies. The lymphatic system is a complex network of vessels, nodes, and organs that helps maintain tissue balance and fight against infections. This video has provided a detailed overview of its components, functions, and importance in diagnosing and treating related disorders. It's crucial for medical professionals to understand the system to improve patient care.